Oh. Yeah? Y we were you were saying you're about to shoot this dog in the face. I hope so. And I was saying about how Resident Evil 4 statistically is the worst game of the series. Now that's a bold claim. Now if you want now I Are you just trolling now? Not quite. I've got a very like lukewarm, very thin way dead. to that's justify good. this. Okay. People really hate how the Resident Evil series turned action instead of survival, right? Yes. That's well, generally Resident the Evil 4, the amazing reception for 4, is what caused that huge trend. That's what cemented it. If enough people looked at Resident Evil 4, I was like, fuck this, and didn't buy it, and didn't buy all the remakes, that's then true. they wouldn't have It was have a gone... step in a different direction. Yeah. It, it was it, the first, it was the groundwork for 5 and 6. I don't mind 5. I like 5. I, I quite. I, Actually, I do love five. The warm spots in my heart are like two and five. Oh, balls. Apparently, I'm supposed to have another one of these. <laughs> shit! <laughs> oh, shit! <laughs> Robodog, what? where did you bury shit, this? Robodog, where is it? <laughs> okay, wow. Okay, let's see. Let's mentally scan. Right, you were the art scan. gallery. It's not in there. Did you go in that room there, that small office there? You can't get in there. You need... Oh, that's when you the come back. The key, that's when you come back. Oh my god. It's not there, it's not there, it's not down that hallway. Uh, you got a map, right? We can check a map. I have a map. Okay, very good. That's a room you haven't been in, right? Or is that the outdoor that's room? That's the exit. Oh, okay. Oh yeah, right, derp. Well, that's a stairwell, right? Yeah, on the other side, there's a room I haven't been in. I guess I can go in it? Uh, on the other it's side? It's the loop, loop around it's room. It's the loop around. I thought it was an elevator, but I, again, I might be thinking of... Remake. Oh, wait, no, yeah, that's the stairwell room. Or, or no, that's the stairwell. And then that's, the, like, the whole lab half. What room is that's that? That's the elevator. Yeah. On the second floor, there's, like, a whole big room I didn't go in. By the stairwell? No, on the right. Oh, shit! Oh! Oh! Wow! Yeah, no, um, I can't go. I can't go over there because the one on the left, the left top door that has that I haven't gone through is the one with the numeric key lock. And right. The other one's a helmet key door. Gotcha. So I'm gonna go. I have to go upstairs and over there. And wow! Cool. What well, is that? Oh, well, at least I can heal because those dogs almost killed me. Well, at least they're dead now. Damn near killed them. <laughs> hmm. So, you see and agree now how number four is the absolute worst one in the series. No. <laughs> <laughs> Damn it! Not, I thought that not, was going to be slick quite. enough. Not quite. You're not that good of a salesperson. Okay, now help me out here because I missed something with the whole how it matters well whether Leon and Ashley have the parasite. You're going to help oh, you fill said, me in. I missed you something. You said that... It, it, it's stupid because they have the parasite and it doesn't matter. It, yeah, it doesn't. It makes one cut scene where he gets freaky on Ada with a bit of asphyxiation. She stabs him in the leg. Yeah. There's a couple of cut scenes. There's a cut scene where Sadler controls Ashley. Because right. she's had the parasite longer, so he can totally just okay. mind control now, her. Now, let's, allow me to rewrite that bit. Let's, let's rewrite R.E. without them having the parasite. What if, somehow, for the whole duration of the game, Sadler was somehow not pure evil as far as they con were convinced, and somehow he was like, Ashley, your father is out here waiting for you, and convinced her through verbal trickery to go with him instead of sticking with Leon. Ooh, wouldn't that be kind of like devious? Devious. Oh, that's a door too. Is that a helmet door too? Three helmet doors? But you don't have the helmet door key yet. No, I don't. No. Oh Somebody's... yeah. Oh yeah. That's right. That is the. That's the dark helmet. That's the room with the fire. So I guess derp. A, uh, the fire derp. <laughs> yes. Yeah, the fire derp's in that room. You're yeah. right. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So let's go this way. It's not in there. It's not in there. I got the one in there. Right? I got the one from Dawn. Pretty sure I did. Did I pick it up from killing him? I think from, I did. From who? From the snake. From Yon. I got one from the snake. I got one uh, from that room. I the only way you could have missed that one is if you, uh, you clicked pick up and we were talking. 
and you you get distracted. Well, I'm just gonna go down here real quick. Let's check outside. What's outside? You can't go outside. Yes, you, well, you can open. Oh, the door. well, let's find out. But yeah, and there's another scene where you kind of he it's it's a convenient plot device. It's not. It's not great by any means because there's oh no! <laughs> I love it. just she just fucking closes clips it right through his fucking head. Yeah, yeah. It's a it's a convenient plot. Yeah, device. So Resident Evil Four, but could have every only been... Resident Evil game has stupid story shit. That's what I said before. Yeah, but you can't say well they're all shit, so it's okay. I found okay. I found four controlled way better than six though. Six is just so floppy. Like, oh, okay. you turn and he just like does a full circle. You just touch it and he's like, whoa, 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 I'm all over the place. Okay, sweet. Now that's, I'm going to have to try to oh, play. Fuck balls. Oh, wait, I did play six after playing four. Huh. So four was tight. Five was tight. Six was all. Yeah. <laughs> Octodad. Yeah. Okay, the O virus. The O virus. <laughs> o virus. <laughs> I want the L virus, Elvira. It turns everybody into zombie Elviras. Oh, why does it be zombie Elviras? Well, it just adds to the horror. I actually, I watch, I hadn't watched Elvira since I swear to God, 1991. I watched it two other two days ago on Netflix, and it's it's amazing how well it's aged actually. Nice. Because back then the jokes she's making are like fifties, like like dirty eighties performer in a fifties town, so it was already you know retro dated. Yeah. Um, but watching it now as an adult, it was it was amazing seeing the different jokes and the setups, and ah, oh. it and, was just beautiful. It was, and I realized that I have some mannerisms that I actually got from that movie. Really? Like what? I can't, re I'd have to watch it and point them out. But I see people saying stuff, and I see jokes being delivered, and I go, Oh, so that's where that's from. Oh. Fortunately, I can say I never adopted the nipple tassel swinging thing. Fortunately? Fortunately. Or unfortunately. Uh, I guess it depends on who you ask, right? Yeah. I'm saying fortunately. Oh, I don't know. <laughs> well, if I work it out, I'll let you know. Now, you've been in that room, right? Because that's where you got the magnum. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Mind your own business, eh? Fuck you, puppy. That's a bad one. <laughs> I'm going to do that there just because I don't know where they are. There he is. That way he'll stop jumping on you after you walk out of the, uh, berry room. Yeah, exactly. I'm trying to get jumped by these guys. Jill holds a grudge. <laughs> Jill does. Wouldn't it be cool if Jill had a roommate that died and the roommate used to live in Silent Hill? Yes. It would be like a Konami Capcom cross. Oh, yeah. Konami Fighters versus Captain Kong. Captain Kong. Captain Kong. <laughs> I'm just have a look in here see if there's any fucking clues. Now you don't think he got it and then put it in a very. There we go. <laughs> I was here all along. Uh, fuck. <laughs> we'll edit that part out. No, we won't. That's two gold. That's fantastic. Oh, Maybe God. in the part where you first scan through your inventory, I'll even slow it down to show that's where it goes by. <laughs> I think the problem was I only thought there were three. So I was like, oh, there's three of them. Oh, Let's go. yes, of yeah. course. And then four, you're like, how did I miss it? Instead of assuming, oh, I've actually got it. Well, at least I killed those dogs. Yes, because then they won't... Would they be... No, the, when you come back to the mansion. No, they'd be... I don't know, they might be there. They, or they might be, be other things. Yeah, okay. Or like they hunters. They might be hunters. Yeah, I gotta say, I love a game that... Uh, it's... Gets you familiar with a spot, removes you from the it, and then brings you back to it with a different yeah. yeah. Like this, the inverted castle in Castlevania. In Symphony, yeah. Oh! Back then, PSX games were still so easy and cheap to develop. Easy, I'm doing scare quotes. You could do crazy things like that. Yep. And the beauty of the Castlevania one is, oh, you've killed Victor, very good, game over. 
Yeah, that's the best part of the inverted castle, is that it was a secret. Yeah! You you might go through that, and own that game and play it, and never play half yeah. the fucking game. Yeah, you would play it, you'd be like, oh! Well, I killed Richter. Alright, well. Yeah. I'll take you to that's the ha sad. hawk shop, you know. Yeah. You get five bucks for it. And they're like, no, you need to go get the fucking glasses, and you gotta get the silver thing and the gold thing, and yeah. oh my god. And then you just, oh, there's a whole other fucking castle that's got <laughs> bosses and weapons and spells oh, and... The, the great shit. Yeah, the, the like, great the, shit yeah. is in the second castle. Yeah, that was like an intelligence test. That was an adventurer's yep. aptitude test. Exactly. If you didn't get that second castle, like, that's like the fucking badge of shame. you should just take it to the... You weren't ready for it. Yeah, and I bought my Castlevania Symphony Night from a pawn shop. Well, so there, there you, you go. go. Yeah. I'm sure some fucker just played 20 minutes of it. Oh, boo. That's a crime. And I was lucky, though. Uh, full disclosure, I had a magazine that told me where to find everything. Uh, so yeah. I knew there was another cat. I bought it because of Final Fantasy VII Guide. Oh, the crank. But, uh, oh my god. And there was no cranks in Resident Evil... There's no cranks. When did they stop having cranks? Number Probably three? Probably three they stopped having cranks. Yeah, because they had that one crank that was square, but it was like, Oh, you need an octagon, so you gotta grind the crank. Oh, that's Code Veronica. No, it was also number three. Was it? Yep. Yeah, Code Veronica, you have, Oh, there's the square crank, Oof. but it doesn't work, so now you need the fucking octagon crank. Oh, <laughs> Dr. Octagon. Plus. Yeah. Hello. Hello. It's... Wow, Jill, for my memories as a youth, that's, that's quite the top you're wearing. That is, my, my, it's always how I pictured you. <laughs> in my, in my sketchbook. In my sketchbook. <laughs> <laughs>